recently celebrating the 150th year anniversary. Cross County, Arkansas is more alive than ever. Teachers took time out of class to make sure that students were educated on the important history of our beloved county that those before us worked so hard to establish. Residents of what is now called Cross County wanted to make their area an official county so that they wouldn't have to travel to Batesville to get to the nearest land office. With a county of their own, they could establish their own courthouse and eliminate the two-day journey. Cross County's namesake is David C. Cross, who was born in North Carolina in 1812 and moved to what was to become Cross County by 1850. Cross served in the Civil War and earned land through the government, eventually 83,000 acres in the Cross County area. He was also a businessman and a huge supporter of the establishment of a new county seat. Cross is one of the few people who traveled to Batesville to plead for a new county. Because of his great support, his fellow founders bestowed the honor to him of his last name as the namesake of the new county he worked so hard for. David Cross led a group of men to Little Rock to plead once again for the creation of the county. The Confederate General Assembly granted them permission. On November 15, 1862, Thomas Fletcher, the President of the Senate, signed the legislation into a law to create Cross County. The county was taken out of Poinsett, Crittenden, and St. Francis. In December 1862, John Applewhite, William H. Barnes, and John C. McElroy Sr. were chosen as commissioners to select a county seat. The old community names of Cross County reveal a land of grace and natural beauty. Historic names include Cherry Valley, Fairview, Walnut Creek Camp, also known as Bird Eye, Village Creek, Oak Grove, Pineville, Hickory Ridge, Magnolia Grove, Copperas Creek, and Campground Springs. Cross County has definitely evolved over the past 150 years. However, it is still important for us to never forget the history and appreciate what our founding fathers did for us. <laughs>